Hi students. Good morning. Welcome to business mathematics class. Let us start from chapter 1. Applications of matrix and determinants. Applications of matrix and determinants. This matrices and determinants, these two words are not new for you. Because in 10th standard itself, you have learned matrices. Then in 11th standard, you have learned determinants. How to find a minor of a matrix. How to find a cofactor. Everything you have learned last year. So this year, our first chapter is Applications of Matrix and Determinants. First section is Rank of a Matrix. So this rank, this word is new for you. So first we are going to study what is the meaning of the word that rank. So the definition for the rank of a matrix is a rank of a matrix A is the order of the largest non-zero minor of A. Okay. A rank of a matrix A is the order of a largest non-zero minor of A and is denoted by row of A. So now rank of a matrix. So I am giving one small example for you and I will explain what is a rank of a matrix. Understand? Now first what is the definition? The definition is rank of a matrix A is nothing but it is the order of largest non-zero minor of A. So largest order of largest non-zero minor of A and is denoted by the symbol name is row of A. So I am giving one small example for you. Let us, I am taking one matrix 1, 3, 4, 5. So, this is a matrix of order 2 cross 2. You know already. 2 row, 2 column. 2 rows, 2 columns. So, it is 2 cross 2 matrix. You know. So, order of this particular matrix is 2 cross 2. So, first, if they are asking find the rank of a matrix A means let us consider the given matrix as A. Understand? Then order of the matrix you need to find. So order of A is 2 cross 2. So first step is this row of A. That is this row of A means this rank of A must be always less than or equal to 2. This is the first step in each and every problem. Understand? First, we will check the order of that particular matrix. If the order is 2 cross 2, the row of A, that is rank of A, must be always less than or equal to 2. Maybe it's an of order 3 cross 3 means that row of A must be always less than or equal to 3. Now, I think so, you got some idea that is, the rank of a matrix is depending on the odd. Understand? Then we come to the word. Next word that is largest non-zero minor. So we need to find the largest non-zero minor. Largest non-zero minor means it is of order 2 cross 2. So first we need to find second order minor. This is a largest non-zero minor. Understand? So, the order is 2 cross 2. So, the largest non-zero minor is second order minor. So, second order minor means, how you will find means, last year you have learned how to find a minor of a matrix. So, I am finding the determinant that is minor. So, 1, 2, 4, 5. If it is a 2 cross 2 matrix, you know just we will cross multiply. 1 into 5 is 5 minus 4 into 2 is minus 6. Now you got the answer minus 1. It is not equal to 0. Understand? Now you got a largest non-zero minor. Understand? Largest non-zero minor. Maybe 
if you are finding the second order minor, if you are getting the answer as 0, you need to find the first order minor again. Understand? If it is a third, that is third order, that is 3 into 3 months, we will find the third order minor first. Then we will find the second order minor. Then we will find the first order minor. If we are getting the answer, when you are finding third order minor itself, if you are getting the answer as not equal to 0, no problem, we will conclude the answer. So same as here it is 2 cross 2 matrix. Here when you are finding the second order minor, you got the answer as minus 1, it is not equal to 0. So we will conclude the answer. Second order minor finding time, you got the answer as not equal to 0. So, second, that is row of A value is 2. This is the answer for this particular question. Understand? I think you got some idea about the run. When you are doing the problems, you will get more idea. Understand? Then, now I will explain some notes for you. So, first note is row of A value must be always First one is row of A greater than or equal to 0. We will check here by using this example. So, row of A value must be always greater than or equal to 0. That is, when you are finding the rank of any matrix, we will get the answer greater than or equal to 0. Less than or equal to 0 is not possible. Understand? Always you will get greater than or equal to 0. Understand? Then. Second one is, if A is a matrix of order M cross N, then row of A must be less than or equal to minimum of M comma N. Understand? For this one, I am considering another one small example for you. If you are taking one 3 cross 2 matrix, that is 3 row, that is 1, 2, 1, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Let us consider this one. That is 3 row. 3 columns, is it right? So, otherwise 3 rows, 4 columns we can consider. That is 5, 7, 8. Okay. Now, how many rows are there? 3 rows are there. How many columns are there? 4 columns are there. So, now, when you are finding this row of this particular matrix, always you will get the answer. This row of A must be always less than or equal to the minimum of M comma N. Already you know this is M, this is N. Is it right? What's the minimum value of 3 and 4? 3. So you will get the answer always this row of A must be less than or equal to the minimum of 3 cross 4. If you are getting one question as 4 comma 3 means minimum of 4 comma 3 is 3. So when you are getting the answer this row of A must be always less than or equal to the Minimum of this M match N value. Understand? This is the second note. Then, third one is the rank of a zero matrix is zero. Zero matrix means null matrix. All the entries are zero. Last year you have learned. All the entries are zero means when you are finding the rank, you will get the answer as zero. Then, last one. The rank of a non-singular matrix of order n cross n is n. This one, first example itself you have proved. That is n comma n. That is 2 cross 2, 3 cross 3. That means order of n cross n is, you will get the answer as n. Understand? These are the four nodes and the definition of rank of a matrix. Okay? We will move to example 1.1. The question is, find the rank of the matrix 1, 5, 3, 9. Understand? 1, 5, 3, 9. Solution. First, I said we need to take the particular matrix as A. So, let you consider the matrix as A. 1, 5, 3, 9. Now, what is the order of a matrix? What is the order of a matrix? That's the first step. So, order of a matrix we need to find. So, order of A is, you know, how many rows are there? Two rows and two columns. So, the order of A is 2 cross 2. Understand? 
So you know the row of A. That is rank of A. Row of A must be less than or equal to 2. I explained already. So A matrix, this is of order 2 cross 2. So when you are finding the rank, the answer must be less than or equal to 2. It is not possible to get more than 2. Less than or equal to 2. Maybe 2 or 1 you will get the answer. Understand? So we will move to next step. Next what will you do? Now you will find you find out the order of a matrix. Next we need to find the order of a largest non-zero minor. For that this is a second order matrix that is 2 by 2 matrix. So you will find second order minor. That is second order minor of A. That means nothing but minor of A. That's the last year you have done. That is determinant value. 1, 5, 3, 9. Find out. Just you will cross multiply. 1 into 9 means 9 minus 15 you will get S. Yes. So you will get the answer as 9 minus 15 is minus 6. Whether it is equal to 0? No. It is not equal to 0. I said already, if you are getting not equal to 0, we will conclude the answer. It is second order. So, you will conclude the answer. Rho of A is equal to 2. Understood? I think you got it. Okay? Next question. Example 1.2. Understand? Example one point. Okay. Next question is find the rank of the matrix minus 5, minus 7, 5, 7. Okay. Same as last question we are going to do. Okay. Solution. Let us consider the given matrix as A. So let A is equal to minus 5, minus 7, 5, 7. Understand? This is a given matrix. Okay. Now what will you do the next step? We will find the order of A. Okay. Order of A. What is order of A here? Order of A is how many rows and how many columns are there? Two row and two columns. So two row and two columns. So it is two cross two matrix. So what will you do? You know, is it right? Order of A is two cross two means row of A value must be less than or equal to two. Okay. Next, what will you do? We will find the second order minor. It is 2 by 2 equation. So, uh, sorry, 2 by 2 matrix. So, you will find the second order minor. That is second order minor. Second order minor. We are going to consider the second order minor. That is nothing but simply determinant. That is minus 5, minus 7, 5, 7. Find the determinant value. Just you cross multiply. That's it. That is equal to 5, 7. That is minus 5 into 7. Minus 35. Send a minus. Okay. Last year you have learned how to find the min minus. 7 into minus 5. So, sorry. Minus 7 into 5. That is 35. So, that is equal to minus 35 minus of minus. You will get plus 35. Now, see. We got the answer as 0. So, it is the only difference between our last question and this question. Last question, you got the second order minor not equal to 0. So, you concluded the answer. Our definition is order of a largest non-zero minor. That is non-zero minor you need to write. That is order of largest non-zero minor. So, now you got the second order minor as 0. It's not non-zero, is it right? So, we need to continue. Next, what will you do? Second order minor, we got 0. So, next we will find out the first order minor. So, first order minor. Okay. First order minor is nothing but any one of the value you can take. So, when you are taking minus 5 determinant value, that is first order minor. If I am taking minus 7, that is first order minor. If I am taking 5, that is first order minor. If I am taking 7, that is first order minor. So, first order minor in the sense, any one of the value from that matrix you will take. So, now I am taking that minus 5. What is the matrix that is determinant value of minus 5? Determinant value of minus 5 when you are finding you will get the value as not equal to 0. Is it right? It is not equal to 0. It is not equal to 0. 
now we got the answer as not equal to 0. Now we come to the definition. What's the definition? Order of a non-zero minor. Now you got the order of non-zero minor. When you are finding second order minor, you got the answer as 0. When you are finding first order minor, you got the answer as not equal to 0. Therefore, row of A value is equal to 1. First order minor finding time, you got the answer as not equal to 0. That Therefore, rank of a matrix row of A is equal to 1. Understand? I hope you got it. Okay. Let's move to the next question. Next question is, find the rank of a matrix 0, minus 1, 5, 2, 4, minus 6, 1, 1, 5. What's the rank of this matrix? How many rows and how many columns are there? 3 rows and 3 columns are there. So, it is a 3 cross 3 matrix. Understand? So, same as last question. There is no different solution. Let A is equal to, consider the given matrix as A. 0, minus 1, 5, 2, 4, minus 6, 1, 1, 5. Okay. What's the order? How many rows and how many columns? 3 rows and 3 columns are there. So, what's the order? Order of A is 3 cross 3. So, I said this is right. If order of A is 2 cross 2 means, Row of A must be always less than or equal to 2. So now what will happen? Then row of A, that is rank of A value must be always less than or equal to 3. Maybe 3, otherwise 2, otherwise 1. Okay. So less than or equal to 3. What's the next step we will do? It's a 3 cross 3 matrix. So 2 cross 2 matrix means first we will start from second order minor. It's a third degree, that is third order matrix means what will you do? First we will find the third order minor. So, we will start from third order minor. Third order minor. That is nothing but determinant value. Determinant value. 0, minus 1, 5. 2, 4, minus 6, 1, 1, 5. Okay. Third order minor. How will you find the minor of a 3 cross 3 matrix? You know, last year we had it. More than one exercise, we have learned how to find the minor of a matrix. So, you know how to find the minor. Just I am. So, how we will find the minor? Okay. Just I am recalling you. That is 0 into. That is 0 into this particular column and this row you will cancel. Is it right? So, 0 into 4 minus 6, 1, 5. Okay. Next digit, what will you Next number, what will you do? Minus of. Is it right? So, minus of. Minus 1 into next this particular column and this row will get cancelled. So 2, 1, minus 6, 5. Okay. Next one is plus 5 into this and this will get cancelled. So 2, 4, 1, 1 you will get. Okay. So that is equal to 0 into 4, 5, sir, 20. So minus of minus that is minus of minus 6. So minus into minus plus 1 into 2 into 5 10 minus of minus again minus of minus 6 plus 5 into 2 into 1 is 2 minus that is equal to 0 into that is 20 plus 6 is 26 plus 1 into 10 plus 6 is 16 plus so 5 into 2 minus 4 minus minus 2. Okay. So, 0 into any number. How much you will get? 0 plus 16 minus 10. Add subtract it. So, 6. Whether it is equal to 0? No. It is not equal to 0. So, we can conclude the answer. Is it right? If you are not getting not equal to 0. If you are getting the answer as 0, we need to find the second order minus. If you are getting the answer second order minor also 0, you will find the first order minor. That is the procedure of finding the rank of a matrix. So, here in this question, you got the third order minor is not equal to 0. Therefore, we will conclude the answer. Third order minor is non-zero. So, row of A is equal to 2. 
this is the answer for this question. Understand? If it is 0, you need to find the second order minor. Now, third order minor, you got the answer as not equal to 0. So, row of A value is 3. Understand? I hope you got it. Okay? Next, example 1.4. Find the rank of the matrix 5, 3, 0, 1, 2, minus 4, minus 2, minus 4, 8. Okay? This is also order 3 cross 3. So, first, what will you do? Let A equal to 5, 3, 0, 1, 2, minus 4, minus 2, minus 4, 8. Is it right? Yes. Next, we will find the order of A. What is the order of A? Order of A is how many rows and how many columns are there? 3 row and 3 columns. So, it is 3 cross 3. So, you know, is it right? So, row of A value must be always less than or equal to I said this is right order of A is 3 that is 3 cross 3 means you will find the third order minor first. So first we will find the third order minor. Third order minor that is just a determinant value of 5, 3, 0, 1, 2, minus 4, minus 2, minus 4, 8. Same as last problem we are going to find the determinant value here is equal to 5 into this and this will get cancelled. So, 2 minus 4 minus 4, 8. Okay. You know already because of that I am moving further. That is minus 3 into this and this will get cancelled. So, 1 minus 4 minus 2, 8 plus 0 into this and this will get cancelled. So, 1, 2 minus 2 minus 4. Okay. We will find the determinant value 5 into 2 into 8 is 16 minus of this one. So, that is minus 16. Minus 3 into 8 plus 8. Okay. So, sorry. Here minus into minus we will get plus. So, you will get minus. Then plus 0 into minus 4 minus of minus plus 4. So, you will get the answer 5 into 0 minus 3 into 0 plus 0 into 0. So, you got the answer as here 0, 0, 0. So, what is the answer? 0. Is it right? 0. You know this one. Is it right? How to find the minor? Because of that, I moved falsely. So, is equal to 0. Okay. I said in the last question, third order minor is equal to 0. So, next what will you do? Second order minor. Okay. Second order minor. How we will choose the second order minor? Means, as per your wish, you can choose any one of the 2 by 2 matrix from this 3 by 3 matrix. You can choose this 5, 3, 1, 2. That's a 2 by 2 matrix. Otherwise, you can choose this one. 3, 0, 2, minus 4. You can choose that one. Otherwise, 1, 2, minus 2, minus 4. You can choose. Otherwise, 2, minus 4, minus 4, 8. So, any one of the 2 by 2 matrix, you can choose from there. Okay. So, I am going to choose 1, 2. This one, I am going to choose. You can choose anything. So, 5, 3, 1, 2. Okay. So, how much will get? 5, 2, sir. 10. Minus 3, 1 is 3. So, 10 minus 3, how much? 7, is it right? Whether it is equal to 0, no, it is not equal to 0. Now, we can conclude the answer. You got the answer as order of a largest non-zero minor. Is it right? Order of a largest non-zero minor, you got. Is it right? The answer is not equal to 0. So, therefore, what is the answer? Row of A is equal to second order minor finding type. You got the answer as not equal to 0. So, the row of A is equal to 2. This is the answer for this particular question. Understand? Example 1.5. Find the rank of the matrix 1, 2, minus 1, 3, 2, 4, 1, minus 2, 3, 6, 3, minus 7. What about the order of this particular matrix? How many rows and how many columns are there? How many rows and how many columns are there? How many rows are there? 3 rows and 4 columns are there. Is it right? So, let us consider the given matrix as A. So, let A is equal to 1, 2, minus 1, 3. Then, 2, 4, 1, minus 2, 3, 6, 3, minus 7. So, next what will you do? Order of A. Order of A is how many rows are there? 3 rows and 4 columns are there. Is it right? So, I said, is it right? In the note, I have taught you. 
In the note, I have taught you that is if A is the matrix of order M cross N, that is 3 cross 4 minutes, row of A must be less than or equal to the minimum of M comma N, I say, minimum value of M comma N. Now, in this question, we have order as 3 cross 4. So, what is the minimum value of 3 cross 4? What is the minimum value of 3 cross 4? 3 is the minimum. So, row of A must be less than or equal to Understand minimum value we need to choose. Understand if it is not a square matrix that means 2 cross 2, 3 cross 3. That it is not there means you will choose the minimum of this two values. That is 3 cross 4 means the minimum is 3. Okay. Row of A is less than or equal to 3. So first you will find the third order minor. We don't know to find fourth order minor. Is it right? So you will start from third order minor. Third order minor. I said in the previous question, as per your wish, you can choose any one of the third order minor. Okay. So, only one third order minor I will find for you. Okay. So, remaining uh, totally from here, if you are choosing means four third order minors, you can choose. So, I will give the matrix for you. You need to work out. Okay. I will do one, one third order minor for you. So, now I am choosing this first three rows and first three columns. That is one. 2, minus 1, 2, 4, 1, 3, 6, 3. Okay. First 3 rows and first 3 columns I have chosen. Now let us find the minor. That is equal to 1 into this and this will go. So 4, 1, 6, 3 you will get. Minus 2 into this and this will go. So 2, 3, 1, 3 you will get. The next value is minus 1. This and this will go. So 2, 4, 3, 6 you will get. That is equal to 1 into 4, 3 is a how much? 12. Minus 6. Minus 2 into 2, 3 is a 6 minus 3. Minus 1 into 12 minus 12. Okay. That is equal to 1 into, you know already because of that I am moving fastly. So, 12 minus 6 minus 6. Minus 2 into 6 minus 3 is 3. Minus 1 into 0. Now, 6 minus 6 you got the answer is 0. Now you will think uh, we got the answer third order minor is 0. So we can move to second order minor. No. Like that you will think. So it's wrong. So maybe sometimes there is a chance to get if you are choosing. I, I chosen this 3 by 3 matrix from this one. Okay. If you are choosing another pair of 3 cross 3 matrix there is a chance to get a not equal to 0 value. Yes. So we need to check each and everything. Understand? Let us check for everything, okay. So, I, am I will choose for you and I will give. So, each and everything minor, you will get the answer as 0. Okay. Now, I have chosen the next uh, 3 by 3 matrix, okay. That is first row, first column, second, sorry, third column and fourth column, okay. This also I have checked, you got 0. So, you your work is going to, you are going to check this too, okay. I wrote simply 0. Okay, if you are finding, you will get the answer as 0. That's your work. You find same as this one, third order minor. You need to find this. Digit. I have cho uh, chosen from here. That is 1, 2, 3. Then first, first of all, I, I have took here first three columns. Next, I have omitted second column. Next, I have omitted third column. Next, I have omitted fourth column. And I have split it as fourth column. Uh, matrices okay two of them i have found out you need to find this two also you will get the answer as zero now you come to know all the third order minors are zero is it right so what will you do maybe i said no maybe this one you will get zero this one also you will get zero maybe this one you got the number so you will conclude the answer is it right for that only we are checking each and every minor okay now you will come to second order minor Okay, for second order minor, we can choose any one of the second order. That is 2 by 2. Anything you can choose from here. So, now I am going to choose this one. Okay, if you need, you can choose anything. Okay, otherwise 1 by 1 you choose and find out. So, I am giving one small hint here. Okay, for example, I am choosing first two, uh, this one and this one. That is 1, 2 and 2, 4 I am choosing. You just wait and see. That is 1, 4 is 4, is it right? 4 minus 4, you got the answer as 0. Is it right? Each and everything you need to check like this. Okay. Shall we take the next one? I am taking next one. That is 2 minus 1 and 4, 1. Yes. Okay. Now check it. 
how much you will get 2 minus of minus is plus 4 is it right how much you got 6 not equal to 0 so we can stop is it right maybe uh, you will think first we have found out no that time itself you got 0 so we will skip to first order minor no it's wrong so each and everything second order minor means each and every set you need to find so first of all i got 0 so i have chosen next 2 by 2 matrix and i have found out now i got the answer as not equal to 0 so i am going to stop here so second order minor finding that i got the answer as not equal to 0 so what's the answer row of a value is equal to 2 understand okay you got it okay so find the rank of the matrix this is a 3 cross 4 matrix. So, minimum of 3 comma 4 you will get the answer. You find the third order minor. First, when you are finding that you got the 0. Next, you choose next set. Next, you find out. You want to find out each and every 3 cross 3 matrix from that particular matrix. Next, you find the second order minor. There also each and everything you need to find. So, now here first I am choosing time I got 0. So, next set I am choosing them, no problem. I got the answer. So, I conclude the answer as row of A is equal to 2. Okay. These are the 5 example problems in the first section. So, first section over. Next section, we are going to learn the eclan form and finding the rank of the matrix. That is, this one, you have found out the rank of the matrix. Next uh, section, you are going to find out the rank of the matrix by using elementary transformation understand by using elementary transformation when you are getting the question you will get like this that is find the rank of the matrix using elementary transformation like that they asked means you need to use the next section method okay that is extremely different from this method okay so these are the five examples here in your exercise, if you are going through their ex exercise 1.1, first Roman, if you are seeing that their first Roman, uh, totally 7 or 8 questions are there. So, you go through that one, uh, 8 problems are there. That is exercise 1.1, first Roman 1 to 8. All the questions are find the rank of the matrix. So, from there, I am going to give uh, one or two assignments for you note it okay so same as this model you need to do okay one to eight all the questions are uh, same model whatever we did that one only but uh, we are uh, totally eight questions are there so we are going to practice four problems in this method and four problems in next section method okay so in this question they not asked simply they asked to find the rank of each of the matrix but we are going to do four problems in this method for your practice and next four problems in next method. Okay. So, take down the home assignments for you. Okay. Exercise 1.1, 1, 1 to 8 is there. So, first question you need to do. Then fourth question you need to do. Then sixth problem you need to do. Then third question you need to do. Okay. So, 1, 3, 4 and 6 is your home assignment. So, Sit now with self and try to complete now with self. Okay, so just um, over you overview what uh, we have learned today. Okay, so first thing is rank of a matrix. We have learned that is first one is rank of matrix definition order of largest non zero minor of A. There, I have taught you notes for you row of A value must be always greater than or equal to zero. If A is the matrix of order M cross N, then row of A is less than or equal to minimum of M comma N. Then rank of a zero matrix is zero. The next one is the rank of a non-singular matrix of order N cross N is N. Okay. So, these are the important nodes we are going to use. So, find the rank of the matrix. How to find the rank of the matrix 2 by 2? First step itself, if it is the zero, uh, not equal to zero, we will conclude the answer in the Next question, second order minor, we are getting 0. So, you will find the first order minor. Then, third question, um, 3 by 3 matrix, we have learned. Third order minor, not equal to 0. So, you will conclude the answer. The next one is, example 1.4, third order minor is equal to 0. Then, you will come to second order minor. Then, 1.5 question, that is exam, uh, row of A value. 
that is minimum of m comma n you need to choose then you will find third order minor for each and every three plus three matrix i have did only two you need to work out this one and take it in your note okay don't write like this simply you need to work out like this and you need to find out whether it is zero or not okay the next one is second order minor if you are finding right you got the answer as o of a is equal to 2 as students i hope you all of you got this first section don't leave this first day itself start to learn from first onwards concentrate and work out practice more and learn each and every day portion don't leave anything work out all the home assignments whatever i am giving okay okay students we will uh, meet in the next class with a new topic rank of a matrix by using elementary transformation thank you students be safe